shows our fortitude. I've always said it's good to be smart, but the most important ingredient is stamina. Outlast the bastards. And that's exactly what we have to do. Now, for the past 55 years, I started when I was two. I have every year, usually in a public park, read the Declaration of Independence and the Constitution. We're all here. And for the last 16 years, we were joined by the public, wow. including okay. the Granny Peace yeah. Day yeah. and the Raging Granny, yeah. so that commentary as well as song is interspersed throughout this period. Now, uh, this July 4th, we, as a country, are facing some very serious, substantial problems. There's many, and in view of the rain, and hoping we can get through, as Zul said before, we better read the Bill of Rights before they disappear. Uh, and they are disappearing. Uh, we have a very serious, divided country. On a lot of the issues now, it's, it's very close. A lot of them 51, 49, 52, 48. Uh, and, and second, the theme, at least for my concern, especially with the Supreme Court, not only last year on overturning Roe, but this year overturning Bakke and Ruder, which are the affirmative action cases. And we'll deal with also with the Colorado web designer in a couple of minutes, because uh, that was really a invented lawsuit it never should have been to begin with, but I'll get to that a little later, and, and I'm sure other people will join in too. But there's an unwillingness to accept freedom, justice, equality, and fairness for people, especially people of color, especially the black and Latino community, especially the LGBTQ plus community, definitely women, <laughs> uh, definitely seniors, and definitely low-income people all across the country. So we have to remember that we have to continue to fight back peacefully, of course, and continue using the First Amendment to be able to protest and continue to speak up, because if we don't do that, the changes are going to happen even quicker than they're happening now. So. Uh, what we'd like to do is to, again, go through some of the stuff about the Declaration and the uh, Constitution. So I I've, I've brought a couple of declarations and a Constitution or two. So what I always like to have is other people read some of the provisions. And in view of the weather, we're going to try to make it even shorter. And we're going to intersperse it periodically every five or six minutes with another song from the grannies. Is that okay? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. So who would like to read? I'll take, come on up. And what I've done in yellow, and then I put brackets because we're not going to do if it was sunny and 85 degrees. Just read 